Hey guys, I'm GS Fear, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to add this stream subathon widget that's going to automatically update with every sub and however many bits that you decide to set, as you see right there. So I'm going to show you real quick just an example. Cypress Law cheered 100 bits, Cypress adding Law one minute. One cheered Dex 100. Let's go to streamelements.com. So, what you have to do first, go to streamelements.com. And then log in with your Twitch, go to your dashboard or log in with it. So once you do that, you are going to come into Discord. Now, if you have not joined the Stream Elements Discord yet, you are going to want to do that right now. And then you're going to come down to the widget share and scroll all the way up here to the Stream Marathon by Harvey Toad Face. So after you do this, you are going to click on this streams.net stream marathon by Harvey Toad Face. Also, Shout out to Harvey Toadface for making this amazing widget. Also, be sure to check the links below for a link to his YouTube channel. So after you do this, it will actually make you a, an overlay right here that you can edit. So stream marathon by Harvey Toadface, go to edit. So once you get here, I've already edited mine a bit. You double click on the layers, go to settings, time config. Now this is probably the most important part. The initial stream length in hours you can have a max stream length in hours set sub increments which means every single sub that you get will add this certain amount of time to your widget or your subathon set the minimum bit donation i have it for a hundred set bit increment for per minute so i have a uh, hundred bits is going to add one minute set the currency you could do pounds, you could do USD, whatever you want. Set minimum donation amount, $5. So you would add five minutes with this donation right here. So after that, you go to the style. You can change the font to whatever you want it to. You can also change the text color, the background color, as well as the border color. So after that, you go to the info panel. Now, as you see right here, on the screen it will give like a little like a little alert right look a little pop-up you can actually either show that or turn that off on yours if you don't want it so i don't really want it so i'm going to turn it off show every x minutes we're just going to delete that so then we're going to hit save you are then going to copy the url right here and then come over to your obs right here and then you will add it as a browser source just boom 1920 by 1080 and there you go it should pop up on the screen as you see right there right above me so i hope this video did help you guys out if it did please consider hitting that subscribe button the notification ding ding and don't forget to leave a like it helps tremendously push me out to a whole lot of other people in the algorithm so definitely let me know in the comments what you want to see next and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.